My character is uh, Book. I'm the manager of the Orient Express uh, and also friend and companion to Mr. Poirot. So I, uh, I become the Watson to his homes uh, in this investigation. It's all bit. It's just a huge joy. I mean, when you get it's such a rich uh, script. That's what I first when I first read it. I thought, wow, it's so rich. And um, of course, the, the the stakes are very high. You know, a murder happening and. Um, uh, it's very sort of big, but it's great fun to play. It was really, really, really fun. He does it, man. He makes it look so easy. I, I was very lucky. I worked with Ken on stage before. Um, and watching him flow between the two, uh, I just kind of got used to it now. I, he never ceases to amaze me every day. I was sort of mind boggled by how he did it. He'd be acting us off the camera. He'd be directing the whole thing. And then he'd have time to crack a joke and make everyone laugh as well. He's a real inspiration. Puts the rest of us to shame. It was, I think Derek summed it up very well. I mean, everyone was very nervous, I think. It's such a big cast. Usually on a film, you maybe work with one, two, maybe three people, but um, uh, it was such a huge family and everyone was just interested in telling one story. And uh, yeah, we became very, very close. There was no egos. It was just one very big, it was like a theater troupe. It was really great. Well, I think uh, Ken's done a few new things with this, you know, and, uh, and the writers, they added a few things, they mixed a few things up. What Ken really wanted to talk about though was uh, in this film is, um, it's not so much a who done it, but a why done it. And I think that hasn't really been explored in a film version. In the book, it's very much there. That's why Agatha Christie wrote this. It's looking at why people might commit murder, not necessarily committing a murder and getting away with it. Um, and it questions you on a deeper level than a, than a standard who done it. Um, and I mean, the size of the thing is absolutely massive. It goes all over the world, it explodes. Uh, it looks stunning. I, I mean, I, I was working on it every day for months, but I still, uh, made me almost cry, the, especially the end shots. They're like paintings, they're beautiful. There was one point when Josh, Ken and me were doing a very intense scene and um, something happened that made us laugh so much. There were tears streaming down mine and Ken's eyes. Josh hadn't quite noticed and then as soon as he did, it must be on some blooper reel somewhere. There was just tears of laughter for a good 10, 15 minutes. It was wonderful. It takes someone of uh, very strong uh, will to pull off a massage like that. Ken does it with a plum. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'd look ridiculous with it, but um, nah, he's, he can have all that. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, Is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey!